story this hour. Two more women claim Donald Trump uh, made unwanted sexual advances years ago, leading the Republican presidential nominee to fire back at his latest accusers. At least eight women now accuse Trump of sexual assault, including the two who stepped forward on Friday. One says she was assaulted at a New York nightclub. The other is a former contestant on The Apprentice. I took this test to put space between us, and I said, come on now, get real. He beat, he's taking my words back to me. Get real. As he began dressing his genitals. Trump denies the accusations, calling the women liars and sick women. And on Friday, he mocked them at a campaign event in North Carolina. Oh, I was with Donald Trump in 1980. I was <coughs> with him on an airplane. She would not be my first choice, that I can tell you. Trump called the allegations fabricated and accused the media of pushing the story to support Hillary Clinton's campaign. <laughs> Hillary Clinton's campaign is the target of yet another document released by WikiLeaks. The anti-secrecy group published more emails allegedly taken from Clinton's campaign chairman, John Podesta. Huh. Series Interesting. Of campaign staffers asked Bill Clinton to cancel a speech he planned to give to Morgan Stanley executives. Trump has hackers from Russia. Hilarious. <laughs> Bussing tables at Denny's. Need to do to close this trust deficit, or is that even something she can change voters' minds about at this point? Her, her trustworthiness, or at least her perceived trustworthiness, does seem to be the main obstacle standing between her and the overall point. <sighs> Whether she can actually overcome those negative perceptions about her is a completely separate question. I mean, you could imagine that, for example, if she had taken this advice and had gone to Denny's or a Denny's. She doesn't want to work at Denny's. What a bitch. What a fucking bitch. On the other side, Donald Trump is calling the accusations against him pure fiction and outright. Oh, God. Give me a break. This is free and open journalism?